Hey everyone. Ooh. Hey everyone. So today um, I just have a barn bag tour and also a little mini haul and a couple of small updates. So first with the updates, um, actually I had a show on Sunday and today is Wednesday. So I might have like a, just a quick video on that and how I did and the pony that I'm riding. So I'll have all the information in that video and also I have an IA show on Saturday, which today is Wednesday, so three days from now. Um, and I will do, and it's an IA show, so I will kind of do an IA show, like, show preparations, what you should bring, and also, like, a show morning that usually what I do. Um, and also, so for new videos, um, I might do a updated tack box tour because, uh, that's changed a lot, and I actually have two now, um, and a at-home tack box tour because that is... Yeah, and then I also will do a saddle pad collection. Um, and I just have so many video ideas. I just, if you want to see one, like, a lot, then just put it in the comments below because I might not do half of these. I don't really know. But, anyways, um, Tic Tacs. This I actually bought because I need this container for this. This is actually a bed, um, bed Bath & Body Works uh, shampoo and conditioner, like, little travel size container. And I had a headache once, and I really needed ibuprofen, and my friend had some, thankfully. So I just thought I'd use this little container and put these in because I didn't have any of these containers. But now that I had some, I'm kind of like, oh, okay, but this just works fine. Alright, then I got these Bottle Cop candies for Christmas, but I don't like any, um, not for Christmas, for Halloween. And I don't really like any of the great flavor candies, and my trainer feeds her pony, um, Smarties. So I just thought I'd put all the, um, great flavored ones. These are actually all of it. I actually ate some, like, without knowing um, in this white drawstring bag, and I thought I'd use these as little, like, treats. I don't know. I just thought this idea was really cute, so yeah. The next item, actually, um, I had at my house, but I just thought I'd show this in the video. Um, they're just these SSG, like, winter riding gloves, but I'm not going to use these for riding. Um, I'm just going to use these for working, and they have grips and stuff. And, um, when I have a show on Saturday, it was extremely cold, like, the wind gusts were, like, like, 25 miles per hour and it was uh 23 degrees and it was just really cold and it was inside thankfully but I worked afterwards and I just borrowed my friend's gloves and my friend's hat which now I have this hat and it just has the little Boston Celtics sign on it which I'm going to bring to the barn and put in my tech trunk because it's cold out obviously um so yeah and these are in the size small and I'm pretty sure I can get these at Dover for like I think they're like $20 now, which is kind of bad, but whatever. So, now on to the actual video. This is just my barn bag, as you can see. Um, this is actually, I don't really know, remember what, like, was the brand of it, if you can see from the sign. Um, and this was, my sister used this for softball. But the back of it just looks like this. And the straps, on the straps, it just has a sign and this little drawstring bag. And then the back is just really nice and padded. And then also on the straps, it has this um, this little thing where I can buckle, but the buckle broke. And then it just has the strap at the top. On either side, it also has um, really deep drawstring mesh pockets. And I just keep two water bottles because I always am in need for water bottles at the barn. And then this bag actually opens halfway, so you can't really see a lot of it. But it does go down all the way to here. But... I just have a bunch of snacks because usually I just put my lunch in here. Um, so over here, I just have a pencil, which the, this pocket broke, sadly, but I just have a pencil, um, a pen, and then a Sharpie, and then this little mesh drawstring, well, not really drawstring, zipper pocket, I just have um, post-its, sorry, an eraser, and then also um, a pencil sharpener, just a little tiny one. And then in the pocket above that, I can close this. In the pocket above that, I just have these um, elastics that I have. I always have elastics on me. And then I just have these gloves. These are also SSG gloves. And these are like the four dollar ones at Dover, um, and they're just place on the side and they just have grips and for riding and stuff and I actually have been in these because before I got my other gloves that I use now which is the SSG soft touch that I use all the time um, and they work pretty well 
the summer ones that I know, you can get them in like summer ones and winter ones. Summer ones don't really last really long because they're thin. But in this pocket, it's just really, really nice fleece pocket and it goes down a whole like a lot so it's actually like really big it's the size of my hand and i just put my retainer case my ipod and my earbuds in here and sometimes i'll put like a little lotions and then it just has a little thing where you can put your earbuds but i don't really use that at all right in this big zipper pocket i actually have nothing in because usually i'll put like a sweatshirt or whatever i need for the day in here um but in this back pocket i actually have this little pouch um and i actually made this a long time ago um and i used it for school and this is actually my first pencil case but it was really bad and i kind of fixed it up um but i will actually show you this when i'm done with this pocket um i just have this scarf i don't really like the scarf but just in case i need it i will wear it so yeah uh since it's obviously it's colder and then i just have this hook i, I actually well that was really weird but i actually am supposed to have two of these in here but I have no idea what the second one went to. So, yeah, it's in this pocket. All right, so in this little thing, um, if you can see, since this is my first one, you can see a bunch of hot glue residue everywhere. So it just opens up, and it looks like this. And first thing in here is just this little small drawstring bag. And usually I just put my jewelry, like hair ties, bobby pins, whatever I'm wearing that I take off, I put it in here. Um, and then I have uh, some Kleenex, and then if you can, you already saw that, but I'll just show you anyways. I just have a bunch of band-aids, and I just have these, the regular ones that just look like this. And then I just have these ones that, like, is less than noticeable on your skin that just looks like that, which you can't really see, but whatever. They're just band-aids. Um, and then I just have this headband that I don't really use often so that's why it's in here if you can see it's so, sort of the color of my hair not really at all um but I always love using headbands I never like I never will wear a ponytail without a headband unless it looks really nice I just have of course more hair ties because I'm a hair dye freak and then I just have this is actually a bed bath and body with hand sanitizer container but I actually use this for um lotion uh, I kind of recycle them and I fill them with lotion with the lotion in here. It's called pink chiffon. I love this one. Um, and I love using lotion as well and I just can't live without it. So instead of use, carrying on the big humongo things, I just carry on these small ones. And then I just have wet ones. Obviously wet ones. So yeah, that was everything in here. I'll actually do this while I'm putting everything in there. But that was everything in my barn bag. Um... So, yeah. Um, if you have any questions, comments, concerns, put them in the comment box below. And also, I can't really guarantee when any of this is going to come out. Like, cause my iPod has been so bad with uploading videos. Um, I probably won't even get this to upload until, like, Saturday. But I hope you enjoy. Um, so, yeah. That's basically it. So, bye, guys. Thanks for watching. Me.